Well, everyone, time for the randomest thing ever for another company to do. Twitter is actually testing out and probably going to end up deploying a dislike button for most of its users. Now, this article came from 9to5Mac, but a ton of other people are talking about it. And essentially, when I saw this, I was like, okay, this kind of makes sense to me. But it's also the most strangest thing. It's so, Twitter's trying so many different things right now, which I guess we'll have to get on in kind of detail in this video. So here's the thing, you know, this person actually ended up posting out this specific, you know, screenshot showcasing like, okay, their specific Twitter account is showcasing. Typically it would be at, you know, a heart, aka a favorite button and a like button on Twitter, but that actually changed to a thumbs up button, which I never really saw before. It's looking more like Facebook, but it also had a thumbs down button as well. Now, when I saw that, I was like, that's very weird because why would you need a thumbs down button? But essentially what that is, is that, you know, in my opinion, from what I've saw here, if something has like a hundred thumbs up, right? Maybe a thumbs down will go ahead and take that 100 to 99. And then for every thumbs down, it's minus one and every thumbs up is plus one. I don't think there will be a separate counter or maybe there will be a separate counter for a thumbs up and a thumbs down. Who knows? But I think they may be just combined. <laughs> I have no idea. So if this ends up being the case, okay, that's great, whatever. I just find it very weird that Twitter is trying out so many different things right now that just really aren't doing well. They just cut off stories. The clubhouse is being very weird, which I think Twitter owns, but also their Twitter spaces, they are like shutting down as well or something like that. Like there's a lot of different things that Twitter is doing right now, which I love companies taking chances. And I don't know how I feel about this. I really don't even think it's a bad thing. It's just kind of, I guess, uh, too late kind of thing. Like we're kind of moving away from this kind of like dislike button thing, even YouTube, which I kind of wish they kept the dislike button there to be honest, but it seems like YouTube is taking away the dislike button for a lot of videos, at least on their mobile app. So I find it weird that Twitter is now implementing it in, especially, you know, even companies like Instagram where they're completely taking away like the, you know, seeing how many people like something or dislike something, they're like taking that away completely. So I think it's interesting. I think it's cool, but I don't know. It just seems like they're kind of late about it. People were asking about this for a long time. So it's funny that they're just now bringing this in so that's pretty much it if you guys have any questions or anything let me know in the comment section below hit the like button that would mean so much but definitely hit that subscribe button more importantly with everything else i love every single one of you guys hopefully i'll catch you guys in the next video peace out till then